three and a half days. A disaster zone. Over 18 pounds of bees that I have weighed as of now in three different buckets. And there's still bees in there. So I'm waiting for them to all fly back tonight. I'm gonna vacuum them up and put them in the other hive with the rest of the bees. I did find the queen. Put her right in the hive. She crawled in there and good to go. So what I'm gonna do is take y'all over to see the bucket of bees I'm gonna put into the hive later tonight once I get another tower on top. I would say every bit of 80 pounds of honey. Uh, and there's still a slew of honey all over the place. Uh, not an easy task, but you gotta have the right tools. That mesh cloth bag, don't use that. I'll show y'all what to use. Hang tight and we'll go take a look at both the bees and the hive that has the queen in it. Good to go. So here's a bucket from earlier, but I went out and bought a second bucket. Kept the same lid because it was pretty legit. This one here doesn't have the mesh anymore. It's got the underside of the bucket, as you can see. Come up with a better system than Mr. Alien Parachute Guy holding over a Ziploc bag. suction wasn't the greatest so I had to put a ring of tape around the edge to keep it a tight feel a tight seal <sighs> little wire mesh in there so they can get some airflow as you can see they're all hanging in there they like to climb up to the top so this here we're gonna go and put into the other hive once I get it five frames of drawn comb and probably five frames of foundation. All right, let's go take a look at the hive. 10 frame medium. Try and keep some of them in. They're maintaining, managing, and keeping that front door protected. I've got to put two more frames in there. That's obviously brood, but I couldn't get to them and put them in here in time from the last, well, from day one, and there wasn't enough bees in there, so they chilled them and killed them. But they probably had five lobes every bit of let's see 9 18 18 inches wide and probably about 10 inches deep five of them loaded and loaded and loaded I can only do what I needed only could do what I could do right so I'm gonna set this down and show you <laughs> once I get 10 frames in here we're gonna put those bees this is the third bucket into here, so I can take this bucket and go get a fourth batch of bees to put in here. And they're stuffed in here. They're, they are stuffed. I'm surprised they're not bearding out, but they're trying to recover. Just decimated that colony. Feel bad. But, gotta do what you gotta do. All right, all right, all right. Gonna open the five fr 10 frame medium. We're gonna put two frames in there. And then we're gonna put the 10 frame deep on there. Missing a few frames in the middle and we'll fill four frames in. As you can see, we're gonna put those four frames into the deep back behind there once we put it on top. So let's uh... Let's not be too foolish. Let's get that smoker going. Oh, buddy.
push them forward, squish them together, get you a 10 frame. It doesn't allow them to come out, but it allows me to lift up. You want to give it one good tap down on the ground before you lift it up so they don't come flying out at you. 